Hey everybody, Sean Mike here from Dragon Gate Martial Arts Academy. I had a couple of minutes while I took my mom shopping to shoot a quick video. This month at Dragon Gate, we are going over resilience. We're teaching all of our students how to be resilient. Uh, being resilient means to be able to overcome, I guess, tough conditions or, or, or tough things. Uh, maybe like studying for a test and and your child don't want to study for that test uh, or they know that uh, learning this month's kata at Dragon Gate is going to be uh, tough and hard and not easy to learn it so they don't want to come to class so being resilient to actually be resilient we have to overcome tough situations we have to learn to fight through certain situations that we may not want to do that's where uh, from last month's goal setting having a coach or a sensei or mom and dad at home with homework or going to a tutor if we're having trouble with schoolwork where we have that coach that can help us work through uh, what we're having trouble with that truly is the only way to become more resilient is when we have trouble with something is to fight through it persevere through it and and make it happen so if we have a project for school that we need to do uh, we need to work on that. We need to get through it. We got to push through it. Uh, if we have something at karate or something at gymnastics that we're trying to learn and we're unable to learn it, we don't want to give up and stop trying because that's, that's resilience is like a muscle. The, the more we give up and the more we stop trying to do something, the easier it gets to give up and to stop trying. So we want to we want to teach our kids and teach ourselves as adults too that when something's tough. Uh, to fight through it, to, to, to get it done, to make it happen, and, and, and because of that, we will get stronger, and we will get, uh, we will get better, and we will become more resilient in life, and, and as we get older, things that maybe when we were younger were a little bit tougher to do won't seem like a big deal, you know, I, uh, when I was in my late teens, early 20s, if I got a flat tire on my car, uh, when I walked out of the house, if the, the, the car tire was flat, that was kind of a big deal. Now, when I walk out of the house, if I look at the tire and it's flat, I go, wow, thank God that didn't happen while I was driving down the highway. I'm glad it happened now. Let's get it fixed. You know, it's, it's not such a big deal. But if we don't learn to go through those things and we don't learn to fight through and persevere things that are, that are troublesome for us, uh, we don't learn to become resilient. So I hope this helps. I hope this will help uh, you, your, your children, uh, all of our kids. I hope we learn that we have to try to kind of push them through things and, and help them along the way to learn to be resilient. Uh, they're not going to learn to be resilient if they're constantly giving up and, and quitting things when it gets too tough for them. I uh, hope this video helps, and I'll see you in class this week. Thank you for your time.